Good evening, everyone. Joe for Jaspi's Hobby Land here. 2016 Tops High Tech Baseball Full 12 Box Case Break Number 14. I think we did 2015 recently, um, but now we have 2016 in the house. Oh, there goes my list. Good lord. All right, here we go. So here on the 15th, on a Wednesday, middle of the week, break 14. Here's everybody who picked their team. Big thanks to Greg N. He got last spot mojo Yankees, but he also got second to last spot mojo Red Sox. Those two teams were sitting there for a little bit. But he grabbed them at the end, so thank you very much. Thanks, everybody, for helping me push this break. I know TJ was pushing this tech break a lot. I'm, I'm glad we finally got it done, everybody. Tech... Tech is usually pretty good. Do I like tech better than triple threads baseball? That's a close call. I think I might, actually. Because I think I I like the I like the variations and the patterns in tech baseball. So like the the, the, the set builder in me the set builder in me really likes the uh, the tech and finding and chasing all those different variations and whatnot. So I think I like that. Um, you gotta like the on card autos out of here too. Can't complain about the on card autos and just a lot of neat parallels. And I, I just like acetate stuff anyway. I know some people are kind of like, eh, they don't really care for it as much, but I personally think it's it's a cool looking set. All right, so we have we do have another case on the uh, uh, on the website right now, jazbeeshobbyland.com, so be sure to check that out. All right, box number one. All right, we got rookies, veterans, old school guys, all sorts of people in here. 12 autographs total, so good luck, everybody. Everything ships. I'm not, I don't quite remember what the short prints are in this. Haven't done enough of these. 78 out of 99, Byung-Ho Park for the Twins. But if you go to CardboardConnection.com, they've got a whole list of variations. There's Nomar Mazzara. Not numbered, but variation. And your autograph... Nope, not, no autograph yet. That's Kent Tomeda. And your autograph is Michael Fulmer. Nice. So it's a different parallel right there, too. Clouds, I think. Nice one for the Tigers. That'll go to Chad. And then we got Greg Maddox and uh, looks like Aaron Nola back here. Next box. Josh Donaldson, Chris Sale, still White Sox, Marcus Stroman, that might be a short print, I'll set that aside, nice Byung-Ho Park, and the Twins released him, right, Twins fans, I know we got some Minnesotans here, they, I, I thought, I heard they, they thought of, they thought about, they did release him, but that they were thinking about maybe resigning him to a minor league deal, working on that swing a little bit to get a little more consistent and then bring him back. Michael Fulmer, that is a short print, one of the shorter prints. And there's, for the Twins, speaking of the Twins, Karen Steele, Twins, Jose Berrios. JV Gaming says, released him, but back in spring training, lighting it up too. Yeah, I think that was kind of a... Well, I mean, they weren't paying him that much, but, but I think in just terms of like, I think just kind of, ba you know, the business of baseball kind of thing, release him, get him back on a minor league deal, et cetera, et cetera. But apparently he's lighting it up. Well, that's good. All right. Chris Bryant. Ken Griffey Jr. Was the Blue Jay short print? You know, I honestly... Here. We got time tonight. Hang, hang on a second. We might as well look this up just so everyone kind of refreshes their memory on this. These cards are going to stay right there. Don't worry about that. We might as well look, right? Because it's... I should have refreshed my memory on this too. Tops. And if someone has this open, high-tech baseball... Yeah, I think the Donaldson was just a base. But I think last year that might have been a short print. It, that's the one thing. That's my one complaint. I wish they would have kept it a little consistent over the uh, 
about turning it up at the right time. And I mean, I'm not trying to be like all about over the over the years, but what are you gonna do? All right. So yeah, so these these are just the standard base cards right there. Then you start to see the different parallels right here. So there's tidal diffractors. Oh, okay. So I think the ones I was calling clouds, I think were tidal diffractors. Blah 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 blah. The orange magmas you'll see; those are really nice, actually. They're out of twenty-five. The red orbits are no longer out of five. I wish they were, but there's still black rainbows, black galactics, and the printing plate proofs, and the green rainbows and the gold. Blah 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 blah. Uh, so here are your group A, group B. These are your base patterns right there. So yeah, those ones that look like a like a Y or whatever. So here are your patterns, right here. Spiral vortex maze grid. So like, the higher the pattern, the the more shorter printed the card is. So let's just go from from the very top. We haven't seen any of these yet. Um, so those we haven't seen. We we would know. I think they're numbered. Um, these diamond ones, the triangles, the one that looks like palm fronds, right there. They call diamond triangle line. You got peak and arrow. You got the waves are a little more shorter printed than last year. The wave and the grass. And they got cube, buckle, maze grid, spiral vortex. So there you go. Those are your patterns. Let me drop that into the chat so you guys can follow along at home and holler at me if I. I mean, I'll basically sleeve up patterns like five through six, I think. But everything ships. So again, base, base. Did I get the shorter prints right? I think I did. I think that might be a pattern for short print. Yeah, it is. No, maybe it's not. <laughs> no, that's just a, this is a pattern too. That's a pattern too. Come on, Joe. That's just a base, right? Come on, man. That I had to sleeve up. Okay, there you go. I got that one right. I'm so used to, I still have 2015 in my head. Um, that is, you're taking the class right now, Eric Bailey. That's pattern five. That's the second to that's the second to shortest print. And these are obviously numbered and diffractors, so I sleeve those up. You're taking the class right now, Eric Bailey. <laughs> Variation class. All right. AJ Pollock. There you go. Tyler White for the Astros. That'll go to Darren McKenzie. The so there you go. We just looked at that. That's pattern five. 5B triangle. That's a short print. Second shortest print. And Nolan Arenado. Nice. Generally, those short prints are in the middle. Nice Nolan Arenado. See, Claw Ninja, we did like 30 plus 2015 high tech rigs, but we're only on 14 of the 2016. So, um, so there you go. Those are just. So, like, my brain is still in like 2015 mode when I see this. So I've, I, it's all jumbled up in my head. All right, Harrison, have a good night. See ya. Thanks for hanging out. Yeah, Eric Bailey. No, we like we say, knowledge is power. You know, like I don't want someone to be like, oh man, like the Marlins didn't hit anything. You know. What a what a what a sucky break! And be like, hey, but don't worry, that was a short print. They're like, oh, I did get something. And, you know, if if you're more knowledgeable about whatever product you're breaking, I guarantee you, you you'll get more out of it because you'll you'll see start to see value in pretty much every card right there. Uh, Rocky, sorry, Nolan Arenado, TJ Rockies, that is officially yours. Sorry, man. TJ who's waiting patiently all day for this break. Nolan Arenado on card autograph that. Rocky's offense kind of scary. Adam Jones, Giancarlo Stanton, no, David Ortiz. Nice Craig Biggio for the Astros. Darren McKenzie. David Ortiz. So that's the grass one, which I think is just pattern three nowadays. Yeah, pattern three grass. I think they used to be base in 2015 maybe. And nice Trevor, look at that TJ. You got the Nolan Arenado and now the Trevor Story. They got a they got a sneaky good offense if, if Colorado ever gets their pitching together. Watch out. 
they, they could surprise a lot of teams. All right, next one. All right. Manny Machado, who's going to get paid in a couple of years. There's Bernie Williams. I think you'll get more Ken Griffey Jr., on that, on 27 that. out of 99. That goes to the Mariners. That one will be Jeremy Merle. So, uh, so, uh, and Jonathan Gray. This is true, genius moment. They have said that about Colorado in 93. But they got to get the pitch. John Gray, maybe? I don't know. He's pretty solid. But look at his home road splits. I've heard of this guy, Babe Ruth. And Henry Owens for the Red Sox. That'll go to Greg N. Nice one, Greg. And then you got the Jay Hay and Frankie Montas. I mean, the Rockies organization have to be drafting like pitchers, just just pitchers with a heavy sink. You know what do they call that in scouting? They call that a they, they he throws a heavy ball. That's what they say. Where 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 when you hit it, it feels like it's a bowling ball. You know, you guys ever felt that? Like he doesn't throw very fast, but for whatever reason, there's like enough spin on the ball or something where you hit it and it just feels heavy. That's what they need. Sinker ball pitchers. They need guys like that or. High strikeout, guys. Otherwise, it's just not going to do it. Nice Rafael Palmero. Orioles for Scott Smith. We got the Billy Wagner. And we got Malik Smith, the speedster. Still uh, Braves Malik Smith going out to Eric Bailey. I have no idea what team he's on now. He was traded like 5 million times in one day. Where is he now? Rays? Marlins? Mariners? Somewhere. I don't know where he is. But he's fast. That I do know. I, I don't even know who the Braves ended up getting for him anyway. I thought the Braves were going to hold on to him. He seemed to be pretty exciting. An exciting spark plug at the top of the lineup. He might have been traded since his break started, Eric Bailey. Truth. I'm gonna look up, look him up after this, and it's gonna be like traded. Nice Sunny Gray. When's he gonna get traded? Donald Brazier with the Sunny Gray. Dodgers could use righties in their rotation. Come on, come on, Ace. Nice Frankie Montas. Ooh, there's two in there. This is the Orange Magma. 19 out of 25 for the Dodgers. Still Dodgers edition. James T with that. This is turning out to be a nice box. Look at this. There's two autographs in here. Jacob DeGrom for the New York Mets. Scott Smith with that one. And what bonus auto Ichiro. Four out of five. Wow. Four out of five Ichiro for the Marlins. Well, Jeremy Merle, not only did you have that short print of D. Gordon, but I think this is even better. Four out of five Ichiro autograph. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Wow, that is strong. Well, the autos for Red Orbit Diffractors are numbered still to five, by the way. Wow. <laughs> what a box. Bonus auto. That's what they call it, Magma. Wow. That that is that is really solid. That Ichiro autograph. Just just look up what Ichiro sells for. You, even Ichiro sells for a lot. A lot, yeah. I mean that alone. I mean like on card auto out of five? What six hundred bucks? Those vault originals autographs we used to sell for like five hundred dollars. Chipper Jones, right, Andy Pettit, good, solid Aaron Blair, Hector Oliveira, 22 out of 99. I don't know if I think his career might be done right. Nice, Yoannis Cespedes, 
That would be a pattern four, I believe. Yeah, peak. Pattern four. Right there for the Mets. Scott Smith. And wow, Bryce. Ho what a case. TJ's probably shaking his head going, why did it take us so long to pop this one open? TJ with the Nationals. 16 out of 25. Bryce Harper autograph. Who's been lighting it up this spring? Wow. Eat your own in that box. Bryce on card auto to 25 in this box for TJ. He's been waiting all day for this patiently. All day. Thank you, TJ, for your patience. See? We got it. We got it. Congrats, man. Four boxes to go. Good luck, everybody. All right, now that we got TJ's hits out of the way, let's try to get everyone else. All right, good luck, everyone. Rolled as Chapman, Francisco Lindor, Jose Barrios, and Giancarlo Stanton. 79 out of 99 for the Marlins for Jeremy Merle. And wow, more for TJ and the Rockies. 5 out of 25, Trevor Story, Orange Magma. Magma. And Jason Hayward, everyone's favorite in Chicago. James T. Imagine if the Cubs lost the World Series. How much hate Jason Hayward would get. Thank God they won the World Series. Jason Hayward can chill for an offseason. Get back into action next year. There's Mikey Trout and Marky McGuire. All right. Three boxes to go. Good luck, everybody. Ichiro, just pulled his autograph earlier. Jackie Robinson, Buster, and Tech. Jason Veritek title. Nice one for Greg and the Red Sox. And nice Michael Fulmer. We had the auto earlier. So once again, that's the Red Orbit Diffractor. They are, last year's in 2015, uh, they were numbered to five, but only the autos are numbered to five now. And Juan Gon Gonzalez. That's for the Rangers. That'll be for Brian Sawyer. Brian Sawyer on the board. With the Juan Gon Gonzalez. You're welcome, TJ. All right, two boxes to go. Good luck, everybody. There's Malik Smith. Yeah, we got to get the Yankees on the board. Kettle Marte. Garrett Richards. Madison Bumgarner for the Giants. Lee with that one. And, wow, nice Sandy Koufax. I love how they inserted these old school uh, old school cards. Some of these are autographed, too. Dodgers with that one. That will be James T. And your autograph is, wow, Rocky's crushing in this break. Nolan Arenado, Trevor Story, and now 11 out of 50, Gold John Gray for TJ and the Rockies. Wow, we got Tyler White and Blake Snell back here. All right, last one. Good luck, everybody. I wish I could put everyone on the board, but 
unfortunately, that can't happen. But good luck to everyone. Cross your fingers. Cal Ripken Jr. Padres edition of Matt Kemp. We got Noma. We got a nice David Ortiz for Greg N. Six out of 99. And back here is, wow, each row to 32 to 50. Nice. Yeah, if you guys want to try some challenges. Nice each row for the Marlins, Jeremy Merle crushing. And the last one is Aaron Nola and his pretty autograph. Good penmanship, Aaron. Philadelphia Phillies, Donald Brazier with a title diffractor, Aaron Nola. Then we got Jason Veritek and Marcus Stroman. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. That was a very nice break. That was pick your team number 14 of Topps High Tech Baseball. We got another case in the store right now, jazbeeshobbyland.com. Thank you very much. This is Joe. We'll do more baseball with you next time. Bye-bye.